The mathematical symbol of today is the Kronika delta, written as lowercase delta ij. And the definition is not complicated at all, it's either 1 or 0. Indeed, it's only 1 when i is equal to j. And in all other cases, it's equal to 0. This means that you can use the Kronika delta for a lot of possibilities, so for a lot of different indices i and j. The only thing that is required is that equality of the indices makes sense. In fact, most of the time, i and j represent integers. For example, when you write delta 1, 2, it just stands for the number 0. On the other hand, delta 5, 5 stands for the number 1. So you see, the Kronika delta is a very simple symbol, but nevertheless, it can be very helpful when you calculate with sums, for example. This means, in the case you have a complicated sum, where Kronika delta is involved, usually you can simplify it. So for this double sum, from 1 to 5, where delta ij is involved, most of the terms are 0. Therefore, what comes out here is simply the number 5. Okay, that's the Kronika delta. Thanks for listening.